If you drive before the sun comes up or after it sets, you may notice something unusual out there. Here it is, purple street lights. <laughs> they are shining on several roads across Central Florida. And now we know the Florida Department of Transportation is actually launching a statewide investigation to figure this out. A violet hue, a hint of lilac. Hundreds of street lights across Central Florida are shining down purple. People have shared their thoughts on social media. I like them purple lights. Some are not very bright. A few Central Florida drivers are finding levity in the lights. If they're going to give us nightclub lighting, the least they could do is play some dance music and maybe hang disco balls from the lampposts. Other drivers, though, say they thought the light was police, a UFO. And for some, the lights made them realize. I miss Prince. Reactions range. Funny, frustrating. But what is going on with these LED lights? Within that fixture, there is a bulb type material that has a coating, a phosphorus coating that is changing it to the hue of purple. The Florida Department of Transportation says they have identified more than 600 malfunctioning LED lights, primarily along I-4 and I-95 at these busy intersections. And just a few days ago, we spotted some purple along the beach line. We're coordinating our closures and things like that with our contractors so that we can work in a, a single area and not be so disruptive to traffic as we change those out. The agency has launched a statewide investigation now. But it's not just FDOT. There are purple lights on local streets, too, on McGuire Boulevard along Vineland Road. It goes far beyond Florida. There's even a national issue with this manufacturer um, and this type of fixture. Utility companies all over are responding. OUC says less than 1% of its LED lights are malfunctioning, saying when one is discovered, it's replaced within 24 to 48 hours. So FDOT is hoping to have all these lights fixed mm -hmm. by April. They say the company is providing free replacements, so that's really nice. Less money they have yes. to shell out. Okay. And we are seeing it on Orlando streets. OUC says let them know. They'll fix it. We've posted the link on our website where you can report it. Now I, feel like take. I think it's pretty, but probably not the best visibility, right? You're wearing purple eyeshadow, so you I match. Think. Hello. Yes. <laughs>